Yeah, welcome to the show today. I just finished a video directed at uh, Rawstar, Prince Rawstar. But the title of today's of this show, particularly, or particularly, is you know, why is my life so bad? Basically, and I'm going to talk about that today at five o'clock, five o'clock California time. Are you feeling depressed? Do you have sadness in your life? Inability to move forward? Do you feel like you have low energy? Do you feel like you have anxiety issues? Depression? Lower back pain? Do you feel self destructive? Do you feel unlovable? Do you have little or overblown interest in sex? Feelings of suicide? instability. These are all symptoms of what's called your root chakra. I'm going to share with you more of them at 5 o'clock. Why some of you may be feeling the way you do. As I said in the last video I just did, if you look at the mind-body connection that scientists talk about, for example, when you get really upset, you get an upset stomach, I once went through a bad breakup. Yes, I've had those before where I was uh, mentally fucked up for a little while. Excuse my, excuse my language, mentally jacked up. I didn't eat for a few weeks, so I stopped eating. Nervous stomach. And I said, this is good. I'll lose some weight now. I know how to turn lemons into lemonade. And I did use that energy to lose some weight. I actually uh, reveled in it. But not everybody knows how to do that. So I'm going to talk about the issues of the first chakra. If you don't know anything about chakras, then this is not the lecture for you. If you're aware of the chakra system, uh, as it is in relation to what issues that are going on in your mind can be mapped out inside of your body. For example, the mind-stomach connection. There are other connections that happen in your body. Okay? They call them psycho... Uh, somatic illnesses. Well, we're going to talk about that, but more of a metaphysical twist. We're going to show the relation with the first chakra and a lot of host of problems, including low back pain, sciatica, uh, anal problems, diarrhea, abandonment. Yes, there's a host of other problems that occur up here, but they come out down there in the first chakra area. So I'm going to talk about some of those problems, or as many as I can find, and what you can do about them, okay? How you can fix it. Basically, it's with meditation, but a special kind of meditation. As we know, if we just do some type of meditative work, it help ease the stress of our lives. As I said in the last video, if Elliot Roger had did some type of meditation and working on his first chakra, he may not have did what he did. As I said in the last video, it's not a cure-all to end-all, but it helps just a little bit. Just a little bit. You still have to go out there into the real world and do work. You still have to go out there and interact with people. You still got to carry stuff outside your door, but you can carry stuff outside your door with strength and power. So stay tuned at, uh, at 5 o'clock p.m. California time today. Hopefully I'll see you then. Well, if not, we'll see you next time.